God. I'm Dr. Mrs. The Cow. Oh, well, map change. Yeah. Mrs. Calhoun. Uh, like, these maps are so short. <laughs> right? We're in BR Yard 3, and your ping is... Yo, if you get zero ping, Pat, you live beside me now. Nah, bro, I got like 200, dude. <laughs> 200. You poor, you poor soul. Let's move this out of the way. All right, get in there. I did it. Shit. Now's not the time to be a pacifist. Mike, I'm a conscientious uh, ejector. Ejector. I'm an eject. Okay, never mind. I'm retarded. I appreciate your help, but I'm afraid those bastards did their damage already. <laughs> if you were trying to reach the freight yards in hope of escaping, then just forget about it. The military is rounding up everyone and everything they can find, and either killing them or bringing them up here for questioning. A colleague and I came up with our own plan for escape, and we were on our way to one of the old prototype labs when we ran into them. But listen to me. If you still want to get out of here alive, your only hope may be to find my friend. <coughs> if you can get past the soldiers, find Dr. Rosenberg. With him, you may have a chance to get out of this place. Dude, what did I do to his vocal cords? What the hell? Oh, no. What the fuck is that? It's my final gift to him, Mike. What you? What was that even? A satchel charge. <laughs> How'd you find it's, them? It's oh, a, my oh, final gift to him. Poor man. These guys are awful. They're, 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 it's like, take cover, and he's just standing against the wall. I, I need some healing. How oh, you do? Yes. Okay. Why, thank you. We should probably also check what's the other way. Put up, Blaine. Let's go do that. We have to find a Dr. Rosenberg. Curious to see what's over. Yeah, we came from there. Right. Hey, there's body armor. Looks like you need that. Kind of. Health is nice, too. Oh, look. Look, gears. It was a gearbox. I hate that so fucking much. I, I know. I, right? I, you know, I, I completely know. It's a... F like, they, they just... Dude, I just, I just imagine the devs are just like this... Like fucking <laughs> masturbating while making this. It's like, oh, I'm making oh. a Valve game. Half Life is. Oh, we're not supposed to be doing that. What? Ah, oh, never mind. Masturbating while playing. Why is there drywall here? Is this drywall? I don't know what the fuck that is. It's it's uh, I don't know. It's cheese. Walls are made of <laughs> cheese. Mike, do you know what drywall is? I absolutely do. It's a are wall you, are... with that isn't wet. Like you have failed me so much today. I don't know. I don't know what to do with you. I know what yeah. it is, but I can't describe it for you. It's just one of those <laughs> things that's like whatever. Just yeah. whatever. Hey, we have Your the machine gun back it. again. Oh, do we? Oh, cool. No, this is the SMG. Oh, this is the oh. this is the classic SMG actually. That's actually interesting. Go open these crates, these boxes. Let's, use, let's spray this and then never use it again. That was a storage room. I'm going to the storage room. Okay. I didn't. I couldn't open it. Cause you suck. Just before you get any temptations. All right, maybe. We I didn't should, even. Maybe we should go to the top. But there's like a bunch of boxes here. Oh, there's so much health here. Why am I using this to open all of these? You know, on, on the plus note, you're probably gonna get your B gun. You know. Oh shit, are you serious? <laughs> yeah, but it's gonna be the shit begun, I think. Alright, let's go up then. I feel like I'm being shot at. Oh, I am. I think you're being shot at, Pat. I got him. Yeah, I got one too. Alright, so this third floor is useless. <laughs> Keep going. I can't get off of you. I, I know, Pat. I uh, know. Fuck off, dude. Don't even. <laughs> Don't go there. I was just, I was literally just stuck. Like, I, all I saw was fucking oh. red Barney shirt. Fuck these guys. Okay, I'm coming out. You gotta be a man, Mike. Just fucking run at him. Oh, well, I did that too. 
I need health, Mike. <laughs> you gotta be a man, Pat. Dude, there's a ton of health in here. Dude, just, oh. just, just, just hug the wall. Hey, oh my cool. god, he got it all back. He didn't even need me. You have like a short-term memory. You completely forgot about that. I didn't even know it was there. That was like, so some, apparently they were trying to... What? I heard a sniper. Uh, <laughs> no one. Oh, they're trying to hotwire these cars, but... Why? They're trying to bail. Or no, the scientists were. Oh, because they want to get the hell out of here. Mike, you don't hotwire a car from that end. You know that, right? Uh, well, maybe they, they have... They're, they're special Black Mesa cars, Pat. That doesn't even look like something you can walk on. What? This. Uh, but you can. It actually did no damage. Because you didn't get hit by it. Nah, it just does no, does no damage. Where, okay, it's a window. Yeah, and I was trying to break the window. I don't know, the map change. The yard manager. Oh, warehouse security. Oh, this is gonna be hilarious. I love wa warehouse security. They're, we'll, we're gonna meet our bros. Wait, wait, we are? Yeah, he, but he dead already. Gonna take some of this ammo because I like this weapon. Oh no, I took two cold damage. How's that cold damage? <laughs> what? Like, because it, it's a fire extinguisher. That shit's cold as hell. Is, is it? I don't... Is it? <laughs> you, you have failed me so much today, Mike. Come on. You should know these things. You're an adult. Learn Am most I? of this shit. I don't know. I learned most of this shit in elementary school. Yeah, but, you know, I learned actual important shit, like... Help. I'm stuck. Alright. <laughs> you seem like someone I can trust. Maybe you. Not so much on me. Yeah, we, I think we gotta keep this guy alive, though. I don't know. Am I doing that much? Right, I'm gonna explore the rest of this room, actually. This is Dude, it's, the next of area is a map change. Alright, yeah, let's have a look around here. Okay, I guess there's nothing here. Oh shit! They're not scientists. Oh dude, it's a freezing truck. Why? Why the fuck were they in here? Uh, they were just chilling. No, nothing. No, just no. Okay. I'm not going to. All right. I suppose a security guard. Why, one day I'll get you. <laughs> just like I don't keep them with me anyways. I know. There's no point. Just fucking get rid of them. I don't care anymore. I, as I said, the frequent map changes and the fact that the weapons don't stay. It's as I said, it's this very beta-ish or alpha-ish uh, kind of co-op uh, imp like improvement to this game. So, what are you well, gonna do? didn't even follow us. No, because he doesn't exist anymore on this map. Yeah, but they didn't even add another one. No, because we don't need him. Another scientist in one of these train cars again. I'm gonna need some healing, Pat. I don't know where you're at. There you are. Right in front of you. <laughs> heal. Stop heal. moving, you little shit. There you go. Thanks. Okay, you're gonna mend the turret. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna attack the scientist. Oh, okay. That's over here. Can anyone hear me? How do we get up there? Can okay. anyone hear me? I'm just gonna... Okay. That that looks safe enough to, to walk past. Oh yeah, totally. Can anyone hear me? No. I'm afraid I'm not Dr. Rosenberg. But you'll still help me, won't you? No. Okay. Still not Dr. Rosenberg. 
Go Call of Duty then, Pat. Yeah, boy. Infinite ammo, infinite health. How are you missing this guy so much? I don't know. I'm not very good at this, Mike. Never play Call of Duty. I never have. Honestly, you shouldn't. It's a terrible game anyways. They're still coming. Pat, when you were in the military, was standard tactics to run into the big machine gun? Yes, it actually was. Oh, okay. But only for the Marines. Everybody <laughs> else just kind of stayed at home. Only for the Marines. The general tactic is, they'll survive. One way or another, they'll survive. Uh, armor. Alright. People looking for Dr. Rosenberg. Why does it got to be such a shitty name? Why can't it be... It's, it's a Jewish last name. I don't know, though. something strong, there's a, there's like... There's a fucking tank there. Holy fuck! Okay, so... The, the, the car just got a haircut here. I got dead. Oh, did you? Oh, shit! That's not you! <laughs> you're not, you're not, <laughs> you're not a military guy. Not anymore, I'm not, Mike. Not anymore. Like that. You can come up and get the rockets if you want. Or are you just gonna leave it to me? I'm gonna leave it to you as I throw grenades. Literally useless. I was in here already once and I died. Good spot. Uh, you know, there's probably a scientist around here. You want to, like, watch your fire? They're, they're in the train cars. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, poor guy. Oh, wait, this guy's following us. What? Why is he following us? Actually, you know what? We can't friendly fire the, the scientist anyways. I forgot about that. Oh, so we're all good then. I, I, no I harm, so. no foul. I want to make it on top of this train car, but I think we destroyed our means of getting up here. Hey, Pat, come here. Okay. Come here. Crouch, I can jump on you. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Got some ammunition, got some grenades. Oh! There's your gun here! Where? Oh, you can have it. Oh. I thought it was the B gun. No. Uh, I was about oh. to be really happy. Oh, well, that's. Not the B-Gun, no. Close. Let's wait for the other one to spawn. Although, I don't know why I'm doing that. Oopsies. Why did I give you that fucking gun? <laughs> I don't know, why would you? I thought I could blow it up. Apparently it doesn't spawn again, it must have been a military guy that had it. Uh, that's very possible. Whatever, okay. You can go through maintenance access. I think it's gonna be a map change here. No? I'll make oh yeah, there is a map change here. I'll just go, go through it. So you're gonna have to deal with uh, the inconvenience of having to. Apparently, grenades do work on the scientists. Just throwing that out there. They they blow up. Well, I don't think yes. it was important though. I think that's why it worked. Can't work on it. Well, I, it obviously shouldn't work on Rosenberg. Well, we would hope not, at least. Well, I don't know. But well, I'm pretty, I'm you would hope not, because I'm totally gonna fucking try. <laughs> oh. You actually did the way forward. <laughs> you thought it was gonna blow up on me. I did, I totally did. I kinda got ahead of you and I saw it and I'm like, I'm gonna blow him up! I'm uh, gonna do it! I fell off. Actually, there's a ladder here. Why am I doing it like. Dude, headshots with the revolver don't one shot these guys. They do. You're not shooting them. No, they down. do not. Yes, they do. That, you shot them in the, the, the upper chest. Can you, can you get through that? Oh, yeah, probably. Turntable controls. We... I don't even know why I'm standing on this. I don't even know what we're doing. Well, maybe you should not touch it then, until we know what we're doing. Mike, I never know what I'm doing. Gotta look around here first. 
I'm just trying to listen for like characters yelling at me. There's one over here. Wait. It's in that red car. Oh, you didn't say anything when I... Oh, here? Hello! I'm in here! Yeah, in that one. He said something to me. Yeah, there is someone. He sounds different from all the other, like, whiny doctors. That's how you know he's an important character. Exactly! <laughs> Oh god, these soldiers are being moved. No! That's... <laughs> okay. Wow. Uh, Anticlimactic. A little bit. Yes, I'm Dr. Rosenberg. Although I'm not very proud to admit it, seeing as though I'm partially responsible for all of this. How did you know my name? Oh, I see. Poor Harold. Yes, our plan was to get to one of the old prototype labs. It involves something that very few people in the facility are authorized to know about. The same technology that brought about this catastrophe could also be our only way out. You see, I was involved in the very early work on teleporter technology, long before the Lambda Complex was even built. There may be enough equipment in the old lab to piece together a device that would allow us to teleport outside of the facility. As improbable as that may sound to someone like yourself. Of course, none of that does a whole lot of good while we're stuck in here. Hmm. Perhaps I could help boost you through that vent in the ceiling. If you're lucky, you might be able to take those soldiers by surprise. Let's try this. See, he's copying us. That's just weird. Yeah, he's, he's a fucking... <laughs> he's standing on his head. Fuck. It's very difficult to do this. Alright, come on out. I can't get on him. I think I'm fucked. Yeah, oh, now, now, oh, now, now you realize. Okay, I'm dead. Son of a bitch! Me up, Dr. Rosenberg! <laughs> There's Pat struggling. Oh, you just use him like a ladder! Not really, you have to jump on him. The bull fucking horse yet. I literally was just pressing forward and I was using him like a ladder. to the old lab should still be there, but we may have to break through some of the newer construction to get to it. Okay, like that was weird. Just, uh, like he, we just literally just finished killing the last guy. And he goes on his little dialogue. Dude, he Sorry. was totally ready for us. Alright, well let's let's get him to come with us. Let's get going. Hit this guy. Alright. Can we use this tram? No. Oh, that's so... so actually makes me feel a lot better now. We know those ones are like the worst ones. Alright, where do we actually want to go, though? I don't know. Probably the way forward. Oh, right there. Actually, the freight... Uh, this, this place opened up. The freight warehouse. Dude, he runs like an asshole. I know. Don't you, don't you just hate him? I say, hate his voice too. It's so weird. He looks weird. Like compared to everybody, he looks different than everybody else, and that bothers me. He's a, he's a main character. That's how we know. Let's get going. Don't leave me here, Calhoun. We need to stick together. <laughs> fine. If you want to come along for this, fine. Come along. Like I hear military up here, so. Now, there's no time to waste. Uh oh. Mike. Yes. Oh no, it's not reverb. Never mind. <laughs> You wish it was. I do. I really do. This is, this is not the shipping receiving man. Oh, what you do? What you doing? I'm killing people. 
Dude, not, dude, this is not the time for a drink. I am thirsty. Leave you, me alone. I saw all that fruit soda you had earlier. Trust me, I'm, I'm I, I already let all that out when we were in the sewage area. We're good. Why is this asshole not following us? Where is he? Oh, there he is. I'll be right behind you. Fuck. <laughs> no fruit soda for you. He couldn't destroy it. Oh, I did it! Oh yeah, oh no. I, want, also, I think it heals you one health. No, you no, it doesn't actually. And now, now you broke the machine, thanks. Apparently you can't shoot it with a gun, you actually have to hit it with a crowbar. <laughs> Everyone knows that, it's just science. Oh yeah. I, <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> oh, you took the expressway down, I see. Yes. Because I got to get in front of you, Mike. Just one sec. This, this asshole has to follow me. I mean, I, he looks like he's smart enough to actually follow us properly, so... You know what? Fuck it. It's a map change anyways. I'm pretty sure you can't kill him, though. I've tried. Don't worry, you can't. Oh, yeah, I've even tried blowing him up with the grenades and it doesn't work. Yeah, he just kind of spawns. Okay, like he's confused. Oh, I was blocking his way. Then we got satchel charges again. Yes, here it is. We'll need to break through this to get to the elevator. <laughs> you did it! <laughs> You're just casually walking through it. <laughs> we should have chosen the Lambda reactor for an escape, but the crew there is bent on fighting the creatures, with all their hopes set on someone named Freeman. Let those fools try and fight a battle they can't win. I just want to get out of here. Alright, well. No, it, it was kind of blocked off. Why are we even taking this elevator? Because... Um, to, fuck if I know. Exactly. He's got some plan. Master plan. Great. Now, now, wow. now it's all red. There's a lot of blood in them, apparently. <laughs> These are very, very short levels. I mean, can you imagine back in the day of, like, actual hard disk drives and, like, actually, 4 megabytes of RAM, how actually, long that would take? It actually always loaded pretty fast. Was, that's why they made it small levels. Because the, the, technically we loaded the level we were already at. Stop trying well, to get in there. Well, I gotta test things. Let me put on some body armor. Sweet. I have 100 armor. Dude, he need... needs to get his ass over here. Yeah, I guess we need him for that. Let's get going. Let's get going. I, mean, I assumed we were security guards. You'd have clearance to this, but I guess I not. Yeah, but we'll remember. With any luck, my fingerprint ID is still valid and on file. Yeah, sorry, continue. I don't. I don't remember what I was saying. HTV. <laughs> you don't remember what you were saying. Doctor Rosenberg, thank. God, you made it. We've managed to piece together some of the larger equipment, but you'll need to oversee the rest of the construction. Excellent, Walter. Finish aligning the power cell matrix, and I'll see if I can get the system online in the main room. Now, there's no time to waste. No time to waste, Pat. I want to go out here. Uh, not allowed to. The way, where are we going? You recognize this? Well, it looks like the equipment is in better shape than I expected. Unfortunately, this older technology does not have the ability to target an Earth destination in its current state. You see, Mr. Calhoun, teleportation isn't as easy as going from point A to point B. We've discovered a strange border world that was somehow involved in the process, which kept us from accurately predicting where any given teleportation event would lead to back on Earth. Some of the more promising research on the matter led to a device that could be attached to the strange crystalline structures we found on this border world. Now, this device could then be used as a focal point and a relay to aid in the teleportation. Well, in theory, that is. We lost contact with the survey group shortly after the device was in place. We later discovered other methods of aiming the fields, but all of the equipment in this lab uses the older technology. In order for any of us to get out of here alive, 
Someone will have to go to the border world and activate the device. I'm afraid you're the only one who can do this, seeing as how everyone else will be needed to operate the equipment. We should be able to get you fairly close to where the survey team had set up, but I fear the likelihood of running into alien creatures is very high. Once you find the device, simply power it on and align the emitters until the signal reaches maximum strength. We'll reopen the teleporter for your return once we receive the signal, but you must hurry back, as we can only keep it open for a short amount of time. All right, I'm going to initiate the teleporter charging sequence now. Be ready, Mr. Calhoun. Once the field is open, it will become unstable very quickly. Simmons, can you hear me? It's ready. Did you get all that dialogue? Yes. Okay, good. You're throwing grenades, I heard. No, that wasn't me. Uh, was it, uh, Dr. Simmons? Yes. That fucking dick, I hate him. All right. I hate working with that guy. I don't know why you'd want to stand in that. <laughs> why not? Just to see what will happen. I, I was kind of thinking I was going to die, but I didn't. Just look at that yellow gas coming out of there. You just want to go straight to Zen, don't you? No. Simmons, release the damping locks and open the field. The field. They were very proud of that. You know, I, I thought there was more to this level than that. <laughs> 